The raid has arrived. The following contest is a triple threat match. Making his way to the ring, representing the Viking Raiders from Valhalla, weighing in at 305 pounds. Ivar is a larger and the more experienced member of the Raiders, trained by the, the great killer Kowalski. Deceptively agile and fast for a man of his size. Member of a tag team that has run roughshod all over NXT and beyond. We are about to see something good. And his opponents, first from Vancouver, British Columbia, weighing in at 210 pounds, Kyle O'Reilly! Matches like these, with talent of this caliber, this is why sports entertainment is in art form. He said he'll steal the show here tonight, and he looks more than ready to deliver on that promise. Here comes the 330-pounder, Bronson Reed. And from Black Forest, South Australia, Weighing in at 330 pounds, Bronson Reed. The Kaiju of WWE, Big Bronson Reed. He has been on an absolute tear as of late. We've seen him beat some big names, compete in some major matches. I think it's just a matter of time before Bronson really hits it big. Gentlemen, Big Bronson Reed is ready to claw through the competition. And I don't think anyone can stop him. Three superstars with one goal in mind, but there can only be one with their hand raised at the end of this triple threat. I've competed in multiple triple threat matches, and the most challenging aspect is making sure you stay in the mix. Make sure you're always just an arm's reach away from any opponent. Oh, the shoulder takes a pounding there. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Getting tossed. I've seen Saxon thrown out of a few local bars like that before. Oh, please don't remind me, Corey. Right to the kidneys from behind. Down with the Samoan drop. Oh, what a clothesline. Forcefully delivered. And he sends him into the corner. Oh, shot to the jaw. Oof, kick right to the gut. And he denies Ivar. Uh-oh, he's searching for something. He's got a sledgehammer. Oh, man, this is not going to end well. Scoop slam. Turned that one around. This is a unique application of a hammerlock. Oh. 
There's definitely an elevated sense of pressure in a triple threat match. Yeah, that's because it's really your match to lose. You don't have to be pinned to lose this one. The pendulum is swinging faster with each passing second. He knew that was coming. Oh my God, look at this. They're setting him up. Double suplex. You know the old saying about the enemy of my... Here's a cover. Oh, and he breaks up the pin. And he rolls out to create some separation. He should have created separation by never coming out here. Returning to the ring now. A pin drop! Oh, wrist clutch. Into an arm breaker. Nasty. Continually punishing man. That arm's gonna be... And he goes for the pin! Broken up. And the match continues. That's teamwork. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Heads out, and he has all the time he wants. Those are folding chairs, but they can also fold you in half. Oh, look at this. Look at the suplex off the top rope. Oh, oh, Jeez. Take all the wind out of you. Great reaction from Ivar. A warning and a challenge from Reed. Oh, and a stop. He'll head to the ring. Ah, oh, the leg toss. It might not be flashy, but sometimes you just gotta toss another person to make a statement. Front face lock applied. It's about to get more painful. Hung a cover, cover. No shot. This could be a tipping point in this match. Roadhouse kick! Man! Setting up for something here. Sit out reverse pile driver! He can pin his opponent right here. Hooked him up. And a suplex! Needs to free himself from the sleeper. Needs to break this submission. Fighting with everything he has. Steer clear of that. Oh. Power bomb position. Throwing down punches and counters out. Gotta find a way to get out of this. Just tossed. Did she get airline miles for that? You have to be in peak physical condition to pull off a move with that much weight behind it. Tucks in the massage. Just a perfect mix of pure power and bad intentions. He's got a kendo stick, a weapon we've seen used to great effect time and time again. This triple threat match is still going on, Cole. I bet Saxton this would have been over by now. He must have had that scouted. That kick's got the distance. Oh, he retaliates. Evades their offense. Inhuman at this point. Re-entering the ring now. Down kick right on. Point. Oof. This 
vicious right forearm. Uses an elbow to disrupt that attack. That gets reversed on Reed. Oh, strong impact. He must have seen that. Oh! He can't take much more of this. Yeah, he's got to dig deep and find another win if he wants to stay in this. He went right into that turnbuckle. Able to interrupt the attack. Will it be? Forces the shoulder up after two. So, so. Uh-oh, Forum's going to cut off the win. Guillotine applied. It's cinched. He breaks up the hold. There's a Russian leg sweep. These will keep you down. These competitors have been going deep into their arsenal all match, but have not found a way to end it at all. Swings in momentum. Every push has been cut off. Oh, jeez. Soccer's way trouble here. Can he get it fully locked in? That did not look good for Ivar, and... Yeah, he is busted open now. It's not it. No, he lets him out. Yeah, I think he knew he wasn't going to get the submission there. Scouted it and fired back with a punch straight to the face. Looking for more damage here. Holy back suplex. He may get the three count right here. his best Saxton stares up at the lights. Here is your winner, Kyle O'Reilly. This triple threat victory, some would call it quite the Herculean feat. I know there is only one true winner of a match like this, guys, but the other two superstars should keep their heads up high after the performances they pulled off here. Unfortunately, there are no consolation prizes in triple threat matches, Saxton, but you have a point. All three of these competitors really gave it their all here. The czar of WWE, Ilya Dragunov. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Moscow, Russia. Weighing in at 187 pounds, Ilya Dragunov. Ilya Dragunov looks ready to unleash his fury inside the ring here tonight. Hey, this dude's been called the Unstoppable Czar. A title that he has earned due to his supreme physical conditioning. We've also learned that Ilya Dragunov has a volatile temper inside the ring. You're right, Byron. That's a trait that Dragunov has used to his advantage. Uh, there is no putting out the fire that burns inside of Dragunov.
Someone's about to be taught a grappling lesson. A painful one, no doubt. And his opponent from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, weighing in at 193 pounds, Drew Gulak. This is a man who certainly is never shy about torturing his opponents. is highly skilled, probably simulated this match in WWE 2K a dozen times already. Well, it's just called analyzing the angles and having a plan in mind. Drew Gulak seems to always have a chip on his shoulder, always fighting hard like he's got something to prove and everything to lose. It's one of the many things I respect about Gulak, along with the impressive in-ring skill set he's developed over nearly two decades. Yeah, and when Gulak combines all that in-ring knowledge with his tenacious attitude, he's been known to produce some pretty spectacular results. But one look into the eyes of Ilya Dragunov and you see that he's more than ready for a challenge. There is a constant fire burning within Dragunov, a ferocity that he can barely contain. That comes out in full force when he's inside the ring. He's truly like a man possessed. Can't quite get him there. Oh, uh, gut buster! He had it scouted. And look at from a back suplex. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. No way. Oh, God! I think there's going to be some second guessing about trying that move again. Dragunov has said to himself, and I quote, I am violence, and he considers himself to be invincible. How do you account for a man like that? Well, if anything, he's too intense. Dragunov puts too much emotion out there, and sometimes that rage gets the better of him. When he goes fully off the handle, that's your opening to exploit his mistakes. But it's going to hurt to get to that point, so be ready. He steps foot in the ring again. Look at this. Snap suplex. And the rope will force a break. What a shot! Oh, drop kick. And Dragunov's resiliency was tested with that attack. Yeah, Gulak put a little extra oomph into that one. Uh-oh. Oh, to the back of the neck. What a lariat. And Gulak is leaving no breathing room here. Dragunov let his rage get the better of him, and we're seeing his opponent exploit that. Oh, my God. Down with a suplex. Goes into the pin. Two. No, he pops the shoulder before three. He got close there. It could be do or die time. Playing possum. Shoulders down. Elevates his shoulder ahead of the count. He's not even close to being done yet. Oh, what a close lock. Uh-oh. What are they going to do here? How about a little gory spot? Trying to find a way out. Elbow into an arm drag. Beautiful escape. Reversal from Gulak. Uh-oh. And Zulariya. Can he score the pin? Oh, uh, maybe. And they kick out it, too. Wow. Oh, sharp knee. Uh-oh. Dropping the elbow right on the knee. This could be an opportunity. Oh, shot right to the kidney. Oh, reversal catches Gulak. What a clothesline. 
They are both seeing red right now. This level of hostility is only going to lead to bad, bad things, guys. Ooh, bad landing. I do not see this match going on much longer with too many more moves like that from them. You have got to be in elite physical condition to pull off something like that. That could be it. He gets the shoulder up at two. He thought he had it. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Ooh, clubbing strike to the back. Oh! Ooh, a strong knee connects. The mad Russian lining it up. Great wherewithal on the counter. Shot to the chin. Uh-oh. What are they going to do here? How about a little? Oh, the gory special. Trying to find a way out. Elbow into an arm drag. Beautiful escape. Oh, my gosh. What impact. Face first with a waistlock takedown. And Drew Gulak isn't being given any room to recover. This is Ilya firing on all cylinders. Drew Gulak has it cinched in. The Gulak applied. And you imagine what it would do to his confidence if he tapped out right here, right now? Oh, rolls through. Nice escape. Dragunov drawing a big reaction from the crowd. Looking for a little bit of high risk here, it seems. Oh, boy, he's stalking him. Watching for it. Blast off. Whoa, what a landing. Showing absolutely no apprehension to putting one's body on the line. is out of the way. Oh, gets put into the barricade. Getting back into the ring. The mad Russian whipping up his orchestra as he prepares to unleash more carnage. Uh-oh. Just unleashing his fury here. This is what makes him a must-watch superstar. Hitting with the foot. Will it be? I think so. Drag off. Got him. Huge win tonight. Here is your winner, Ilya Dragunov. Try as he might, Drew Gulak couldn't get the W tonight. I guess Gulak needs to double check the numbers in his PowerPoint presentation to figure out exactly what went wrong tonight. They are ready for battle.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 449 pounds. A duo that always delivers when it comes to tag team action and the WWE Universe is ready for it. It's time to feel the power of Tazawa. And their opponents, first from Kobe, Japan, weighing in at 156 pounds, Akira Tazawa. I consider myself lucky to have a victory over Tazawa. He is one tough competitor. So if I beat you, does that make me better than Tazawa? Expect the unexpected with Akira Tozawa. One of the most intense competitors around. And representing DIY from Milwaukee, Wisconsin, weighing in at 201 pounds, Tommaso Ciampa. A multiple time NXT champion and has also held the NXT tag titles. And more main roster accolades undoubtedly on the way. some tag team action. These two will be starting things off for their respective teams as we get into this. Deep arm drag. Oh, he knew what was coming. Stuck in the corner, teeing off a series of brutal kicks. Getting him into the corner. These two trading counters, an absolute master class. a break before the count of two. Not yet. Oh, what a kick. Stump in the leg. Akira Tozawa planted one there. Laser precision across the top rope. What a hot shot. Working to neutralize that arm. Snapmare takedown. Oh, my. Single leg drop kick. Lives to fight another day. Right to the kidneys from behind. Jump kick from behind. Tagging his partner in now. Fresh man in. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Knee to the gut. 
Oh, look at this. Arm wrench. Ooh, what a full back kick. Oh, look at this. Oh, kicks. Capped off with a big one. Just never had a chance to block any of those. Crushing the knee there. Oh, man. Nasty kick. The black heart with a counter. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. And another counter. Oh, man. I don't know if they're going to have any taste buds left after that. Kick to the gut. Cracked around into a neck breaker. Boom. Dropped on the crown. Bicycle knee to the face. No, right in the mat. Face first. Uh, this one's all but over. And there's a quick kick out from Tomasa Ciampa. Not enough pressure on the pin. Off the rope. Uh oh. <laughs> Expected that one. Oh, what a psycho cutter. Cover. Two. Powers through after two. He's still in the fight, but for how much longer? A calculating look from Champa, planning his next move. Oh, a step ahead of Champa. Tag was made. Tag made here. Oh, this is going to be bad. Right across the chest. When you see a unit as aligned as they are, it's really incredible. Arm control applied and a big boot to the guts. And Champa bearing the full force of that attack. This is what. Oh my god! Diving moonsault! A oh, jumping stop to the gut. Well placed kick. Tag is made. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Perched up top, diving knee drop. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Clean oh. tag for his partner. Oh, what a knee lift. Somebody better check his nose. He steers clear of contact. Left by the turnbuckles. In off the tag. Powerless position to be in right now. Oh, right to the throat. Not a striking blow. The beginning of the end. Great counter, impressive ring IQ on display there. Oh, right to the kidneys. Kick to the back. Systematic attack on that all. Sharp elbows to the body, looking to fight his way out. off the attack with an elbow. Yeah. Effective arm drag. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. He's in off the tag. Oh, man, he is more than fired up right now. Yeah. <laughs> it has been... Double underarm hook, blocked, and, and a clothesline counter. 
Champa avoids damage. A flat out for the victory here. Shoulder up, shoulder up. I mean, you gotta think he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. Ah, look at this. Unbreaker. This match may be nearing its limit. And he has just taken an extraordinary amount of abuse. Uh-oh! Somersault plunge out of the floor. Throwing all costs into the wind and leaping to the outside. You can feel the WWE Universe reverberating off every corner in this building. Champa trying to shake the cobwebs, but it might be too late. Back elbow blows that one. These superstars are torn away endlessly, and this crowd is on their feet in full appreciation. An incredible sight to see. Here's a tag. Up top, rocket launcher. He's getting pushed out into the defensive. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're gonna wind up with a few battle scars. Ah, oh, stop. Tazawa springing to the top rope. Tag is made and here we go. Going up, uh-oh. Fighting out, hammering away with punches to the face. Perfect knee. Hooked up. Shin breaker. Setting it up. Oh, this is gonna be nasty. struggle here. Yeah, they've stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. Hurricane And he's able to counter. Oh, it is over. Tazawa looks out of it. Cover. And he makes the save for his team. together great chemistry tonight that was a great example of what a tag team can do when it's firing on all cylinders
We are in the eye of the storm now. The following is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, weighing in at 215 pounds, the Hurricane. The Hurricane's a proven competitor in both the singles and tag team divisions. Well, the Hurricane has also proven that he doesn't need a sidekick. He's perfectly capable of flying solo. And just like a real Hurricane, this guy's a total blowhard. Oh, okay, I get it now, Corey. You know what? You're jealous. You're, you wish you had a cool superhero suit, just like the Hurricane. Corey has plenty of cloud suits already. Well, I'll take that as a compliment. Here comes the Austrian anomaly, Gunther. A man with one purpose, to prove the math sacred. And his partner from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds, Gunther. We are looking at the man who etched his name in the history books, becoming the longest reigning intercontinental champion of all time. Once that bell rings, it really doesn't get more dominant than Gunther. No mercy is the name of the game. Oh, yeah. Gunther began his career in WWE proclaiming that the ring is sacred, and his accolades have proven just that. Everything Gunther does, how he competes, it's all about picking up a victory. Winning is the only outcome for the ring general. Failure is not an option. He despises mediocrity. I got a feeling this match is going to be too sweet. One of the most dominant and decorated teams in the world. And accompanied by Mitchell at a combined weight of 500 and five pounds. Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson, the OC. The most dominant club in the world, marching towards the pinnacle of their collective careers. They already look mean, now they just need the green. They make short work of their opponents and head right to the pay window. Pat Sabell and the OC is here, set for action. There are really no egos in the OC guys. They love to fight and then have a good time outside the ring. That's what happens when you spend as much time making money and making towns as these dudes have, Cole. All that matters after that is the company you keep, and the OC knows that all too well. A very tight-knit crew, you have to admire that. And guys, looking through this Hollywood crowd, the faces of the stars are out tonight. Well, thank you for noticing, but I work next to you all the time, Cole. You can stop being starstruck. And Hurricane expected that. He moves just in time. Reversal after reversal, proving they did their homework. Kicks to the face. Capped ah. off with a big one. I think Rage took over in that moment. Nothing but blind Rage. Uh-oh. He switches it back around. Tag is good. Tag, and this is not going to be good for their opponent. Oh. Free fall neck break. 
Joker. That was that chemistry you cannot teach. Oh, stop right to the hand. That was a showing of control and aggression. Something they'll want to keep up. The defensive elbow to the gut ends that. Oh, stiff uppercut. Just muscling up their opponent into the gut wrench. That is the kind of move that leaves our jaws on the floor. Unbelievable. Caught in a bad position here. What a throw. Just got thrown around like a sack of you know what. This is definitely not the way the OC had hoped tonight would go. Maybe this is just what the OC needed to light a fire, to really drive themselves moving forward. I don't think they're just going to take this loss in stride. This is going to be a good one. Yeah, I believe so, Byron. I've been waiting for this for a long, long time. Oh. This superstar's in no condition to compete. Not at all. What the hell? And now he wants in, and he's going to get it. And here we go, and the fight's underway. Oh, oh, oh. He's doing on each other. each other. This thing is broken down in a hurry. Well, they weren't expecting this opponent, but they were ready to go anyway. Well, it's obvious these two have a vendetta against one another. It needs to be settled. And hostilities boiled over between these superstars before they even got in the ring. Now we have a brawl on our hands. The animosity between these superstars is just off the charts. I'm not surprised at all by what's happening. Someone needs to get control of this. Grimes gets intercepted. One response after another. Back and forth we go. Quick exchange of counters there. He is delivering elbow after elbow. Hard shot to the back. Here's the pump handle. Into the backbreaker. Out of the way in time. <laughs> Snapmare takedown. Oh my! Single leg drop kick. Standing shooting star press. Incredible. It's incredible. The inventiveness we are seeing. Going for it. Trying to step through. Roll on their belly. Submission holds. Oh, flips the lever, shoulders down.
Nightmare takedown. A match like this can have so many twists and turns. Corey, what will have an impact on this matchup? You need to strike first. Dictate the pace of the match. Since anything goes, you can add anything to the equation. Each competitor responds differently to the rules being thrown out the window. The key is who can stay alert and remain in control. I wish someone would throw you out a window. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Look at this raw power. Gut wrench suplex. Clearly an attack that very few superstars can perform with such ease. And Grimes maintaining the advantage now. Yeah, Grimes clearly in control. Kick. He's looking a little weary now. The technical skills of Grimes serving him well as this match goes on. Uh-oh. Face first in the turnbuckle. was definitely not thinking about finesse with that one. He was only thinking about dominance. in the corner. A second time. An absolutely brutal set of hits showing no mercy at all. Damn it, Grimes. Uh-oh. Great counter. Guys, we have been seeing the animosity building for weeks. And I know they've been keeping their distance from each other in the back for a while. Grimes with the victory. What a match. Things are about to get good. The following is a tag team match set for one fall. Introducing first from New York, weighing in at 209 pounds, Sue Page Demon. The WWE Universe has been counting the days, hours, and minutes for this match to start. And the countdown is almost over. This is a match he's craved for quite some time. He's ready and raring to go.
He's a total blur. He's moving at super speed. He is the man called Axiom. And his partner from Madrid, Spain, weighing in at 154 pounds, Axiom. A calculated competitor, Axiom finds the perfect angle to strike. There's no complicated math needed to figure out that Axiom is legit. I am actually really excited to see what Axiom has in store for us in this one. Yeah, hopefully we see some more superhuman feats from him tonight. Here comes Apollo Crews. A man who has evolved to his purest form. And from Benway State, Nigeria, weighing in at 241 pounds, Apollo Crews. Made a return to NXT, joined the main event scene there and is doing the best work of his career. Always had the athleticism, but now he has a drive like never before. Time for Cruz to execute on his vision. Well, I just hope he can do that without bleeding from his eyes. Yeah, now we're talking. a competitor who knows the value of respect at every show this one asks me how my day is going and even compliments my suit wow a goody two shoes and a liar what a terrible person <laughs> He's in perhaps the best physical condition of his life. He knows what it takes to reach the top here in WWE. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Tag team action is now underway. The tag team match is a classic staple of this business. It's the ultimate test of teamwork and in-ring timing. Yeah, for partners to compete at a high level here, they have to form one truly exceptional unit, which is definitely easier said than done. Ah, oh, flipping the script on him there. Reversals, reversals, and more reversals. Sweet. Pinning down their opponent's arm. Dropping the knee for more punishment. Oh, look at the well-placed elbow right on the mark. 
This isn't going to be pretty. Hangman's neck break. Oh, gosh. Oh, catapulting down on the opponent. Oh, red in there. Slam! What impact. He's looking a little off balance. Rolling neck snap. Here he goes for the win. And he powers out. You have to think this battle is starting to weigh down on him. He skirts away, living to fight another day. Boom. Uh-oh, hazardous part of town here on the apron. Back suplex. Spine crushing. There is nothing but malicious intent when you deal damage out on the apron. Wow, the rep got hit hard there. Punching their way out of that one. Uncorks a thunderous chop. Cutter! Adios. Reaches his partner for the tag. Got the tag. Got the tag. Oh, oh, oh what a boot. That gets reversed on Apollo. Oh, that'll turn your skin red. Kick right to the back of the leg. Very effective. Having a weakened arm can limit you in so many ways, making it harder to execute on even simple attacks. Off the top, Buckles! What's he gonna do? From the top! Diving elbow drop! Are you kidding me? Standing shooting star press! Incredible! You have solidified your name as a top athlete when you're able to pull off that move. And an impactful display of offense we just witnessed there. And Apollo Crews reverses it. Big forearm. Hoisted up on their shoulders. Death Valley driver. Oh, look at this. Just crank of the head. That's got to hurt. Crank in the head. Targeting the arm now. Oh, deadlift. Look at this power. That move had the amount of force akin to a natural disaster. Strong kick out, but you have to wonder if he can keep it up. Standing moonsault! Why not look like a million bucks when hitting something that effective? Sometimes you just gotta show off and show out. Samoan drop. Apollo is going full tilt here. Yeah, Cruz with power and athleticism. And he gets the tag. Double under hook. Bad brain buster! And if you take one too many of those, we know how this match is going to turn out. And just like that, we've kicked the tempo up a notch. Oh, I had that well scouted. These two having an answer for everything. Oh, what a forearm! Oh, it's through Moonso, my God! What a way! Shoulders down! Still only got one. If that won't beat him, I'm not sure anything will. Knee strike connects. Shooting star. Ooh. As the leg trap, fisherman suplex. This match grinded him down a little. Axiom putting some punishing offense on display. German suplex. He avoids the damage. Tremendous German suplex. Just another insane display of power. Oh my God. Momentum has pivoted toward Axiom. Axiom is doing a great job remaining engaged with the opposition. Oh, in the face! Solely focused on... Ooh. 
Kick to the gut. Double <laughs> under hook. Tiger bomb. Able to evade. Oh, what a kick to the face. Oh my God. position to be in there. There's the tag. Oh, man. Shot right to the midsection. Big time spine buster. Could lead to a big time win. This match is brutality starting to show on him. This is what the purpose of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and help your partner offers. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Here he comes off the tag. Fall away, Moonsault. Wow. Go for the arm bar and up. Just stretching out the arm. Gets tagged in. Ooh, elbow strike. Cruising off the tag. Oh, what a wind up. On the shoulders and a slam. <laughs> Apollo Crews loves to deliver multiple suplexes. Hoping to end it here. He keeps his team in the match. Apollo is looking for the final exclamation. Elbow thrown to break up the maneuver. Oh, that'll leave a mark. After all we've seen, these men are still not finished. There's a fight. Just end this now. Oh, he's playing possum. No, stops the count at two. Somehow, some way, he is still in. And what he's looking for here. Looks like a potential submission maneuver coming. Ah, oh, that's one way for him to get out of it. Oh, catches a kick to the face. Uh-oh. Right to the knee. Oh, hammer it away. He can end it here. He's got him. Got it. No, just a two. Good Lord, scarily close to three. Kick to the gut. Double under. Hook. Future shot. He's getting fired up now. Really feeding off this crowd. Able to get there in time. Hooked up. Oh, man. Great power. Inverted suplex. Goodness gracious. He's reversing the momentum on him. He isn't allowing that burst of attacks to finish him. Mistake made by Cruz. Up across the shoulder, torture rack. Position driven down face first. And Apollo's laid out. Right to the kidneys from behind. We're undoubtedly nearing the end. Yeah, not looking good at all. There it is. Boom. Nice. All eyes focused on this absolute roar. It doesn't get more masterful than this. Whatever's playing here can't be good. Oh, this is it. Fights out at two. The fact that these superstars can still be moving at this point is beyond the realm of reality. 
Supernatural power. He's locked up here. Standing Spanish flyer. Are you kidding me? Incredible. No. Oh, that'll break his arm. Vicious. If this lands, it's over. Phoenix Splash! See ya. Thanks for coming. There's two! Oh, not yet. They just got the shoulder up. How close was that? That was about as close as it could get without it all being over for him. It must be demoralizing knowing you've unleashed your best shot on your opponent to no avail. the back side of an elbow. Double oh under hook. Bam! Brain buster! Tag made. Fresh man in. Oh my gosh! A follow-up moonsault slam? Cruz escapes the Axiom finds the golden ratio. Axiom might have him. That's gotta be it. There's two. Man, that was such a long and hard-fought match. He earned that victory. Here are your winners. Sue Page, He-Man, and Axiom. And a big-time victory for this tag team here tonight. This right pairing can certainly do wonders, and make no mistake, this was a wonderful performance tonight. A superstar uh, ready to go here. And here comes their opponent tonight. Well, their opponent doesn't seem to be any rush to get inside the ring. Yeah, not at all. Wait a minute, wait. Is the superstar walking away? Turn around! Uh-oh. In the hard way! This superstar has no choice. They wanted nothing to do with this match here tonight. Yeah, this competitor has been running scared, trying to avoid confrontation. This match is officially underway, and I think it's safe to say this is... The sleeper is sick in trouble here. Oh, oh what a great counter. That'll break it up. Great reversal. Another reversal. Off the eye here. Into the corner. Oh, watch this. Look at the power and the strike. Inverted Alabama slam. No other way to say it, guys. That looked like it hurt a lot. Forks the move by throwing an elbow into the midsection. Drop down with the bulldog. Oh. Left hook in the mush. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. That type of physicality earning Roberts the advantage. Manhandling his opponent with Drew McIntyre. There's a lot of hard ways to land, but that might be the hardest. To stomp in every single part of his body. You have to imagine the disdain it. Oh, 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 come on. Good luck getting out of this. I guess that's one way to do it. Close line! Off with their head. Ooh, a knee. Ouch. In full 
control of their opponent with more in mind. Discus punch. Strong impact from Jake Roberts. He's heading up top. Thinking big. From the top. Diving double axe handle. There he goes, right into the corner. Bad predicament right here. Piercing the throat. And will this be it? And the referee stops the count before two. So resilient. Stomping down. Ooh, what a nasty kick. Insulting. The disrespect can be tasted in their mouth. Lifts him up, a spine buster. Carrying down the leg now. Sky high! Way up there. And Roberts is failing to offer any resistance here. Look at that. This guy using his ability to adapt and counter the snake's technical skills. Don't do it! Somersault plancha to the floor. It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring inside. The eerie presence of Jake the Snake reverberating throughout the crowd. Uh-oh. Cross the shoulders. Air raid crash neck breaker. You know, guys, I didn't think much of this, but the animosity is really starting to grow here. Right now, I think they're just not seeing eye to eye, Michael. The countdown is on. Will Drew close this out? Sad to say, this result isn't going to change things on the disrespect front anytime soon. I think a true congratulations is in order. Here we go, guys. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Long Island, New York, weighing in at 228 pounds, MJ. Here's someone who has faced some tough odds and tougher opponents, but always gives it their all. Look, I, I know you think that's a good thing, but this person could learn a thing or two about the value of running and hiding. Oh, uh, yes, the value of being a coward.
He calls himself the standard bearer of this division and plans on proving it in a matter of moments. The only thing more dangerous than Roddy Piper with his ring gear on is Roddy Piper with a mic in his hand. Can take a man down with words before the bell even rings. Roddy Piper has made a career out of that. A master manipulator. Expect the unexpected when Hot Rod comes to town. We are guaranteed to have ourselves a knockdown, drag out fight tonight. I'm sure Hot Rod has some explosive action on tap. Some have called this superstar a bit too intense, and as we can already see from the look in his eyes, there's a reason why. In this business, intensity often breeds success, and he is well aware of that. He's hoping that focus and drive really propel him to success. And across the ring from him is one of the more fiery superstars of all time, Rowdy Roddy Piper. Piper's butted heads with legends and won more than his share of those clashes. So you're in for a world of hurt when you tangle with someone as ferocious as Piper. Ferocious is right, Corey. As if his insults don't cut deep enough, Piper has all the power and technical ability he needs to leave you broken and bruised. Out brutal forearm. Right to the gut. Oh, and Hot Rod fights back. with an attack on Piper. He's got him scouted. And the electricity of this moment is coursing through his veins. Float over. Oh, do it. Float over. Nice. DDT. And it's Piper who got burned by that move. Oh, Fujiwara armbar applied, and here's a cover. Fending off a two count there. He is going to take this match as long and as far as he needs to. Golly, that could do permanent damage. Consecutive attacks keeping Hot Rod off his game. Piper needs to be resourceful in this situation. Going after the arm here. Trying to take away that grip, that range of motion on that end. Piper dodges that one. How do you deal with a superstar like Roddy Piper? He won't hesitate to pull a dirty trick if he thinks it'll get him the win. Stay on the attack. If you give Piper any room, he'll use it to set one of his schemes in motion. Keep him right where you can see him and maintain relentless offensive pressure. And finds a counter. Piper gets reversed. Look at this, going right after the left arm. Got to hurt. He's absorbing some tough hits now. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. Oh, that'll crush the throat. He can end it here. He's able to kick out before two. Those one counts getting harder and harder to kick out of.
Looking for a high risk, high reward to the sky. What? Adrenaline can make you do crazy things. Exhibit A right there. Double chicken wing, Tiger Suplex. Ah, look at this. Now that'll do some serious damage. Oh, and Hot Rod fights back. And he tosses him back in now. tonight. Hard to beat a Rowdy Roddy. Opponent making him wait before this oh, crucial is. matchup. That's press! And what a takedown! And now the rights and lefts! Completely unloading as the official tries to get some control here. He doesn't even care! So much for playing by the rules. Well, I say that surprise attack was cowardly, but... Yes, it was effective. Uh-oh, he could be looking for a 
submission here. The ankle lock. It's difficult to get out of the ankle lock, but he's able to do it. Denied and reversed into a DDT. A little rope assistance, punishing their opponent. Focusing on a body part, picking it apart. The arm's as good of a place to focus as any. Oh, kick right to the knee. Oh, right across the solar plexus. Oh, he's got him in deep, deep trouble here. Oh, look out. Oh, oh, what a leg drop across the rope. That maneuver goes to show you how much speed kills. Oh, a moonsault. He's been placed in the corner now. Uh-oh. Face full of turnbuckle. You know, I have to ask, Corey, how much of an actual strategy is there in a no disqualification match? Honestly, it depends on the superstar's mindset. Some just want to get through it. Others want to inflict as much damage as possible, and some just go with the flow. Know which mindset you have before the match and stick to it. Uh, just walking right over the spine of their opponent, now dancing after it. Well-executed suplex. Oh, forearm smash. That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your... Style, style, full through. In the cap pressure, will he tap? Well, this isn't gonna win the fight. Are you kidding me? Elbow, what a counter! What a knee. What are we about to soon? Yeah. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Front face lock applied with the underhook. Good buster! He's in a little bit of trouble now. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes himself to. Whoa, leaping through the air! Oh, target acquired and destroyed. Oh, close line. Looking for a high-risk move. From the top, look out below! The one-two punch of high risk, high reward. The competitive spirit is alive and well in this one. Yeah, I think these superstars are actually fairly eager to test themselves against one another. That means they recognize each other as being legitimate threats to their own ambitions. Big knee to the midsection. Oh, good. Golly, what a knee. Stomp right on the knee. Oh, he's got him in deep, deep trouble here. Oh, look out. Slings uh -oh. a guillotine leg drop. Right in the mouth. Relentless. Right in the face. My God. Tables. Styles with a pop up and puts on the brakes. 